Nick has played basketball before. Wow, a lot of you. All right. By the end of this speech, you will have a better understanding why I play basketball. And um, it was actually, to me, basketball is a sport. It's not just a sport, it's a lifestyle. It was the first sport I was introduced to. And throughout the speech, I'm going to talk about the origins of basketball. I'm going to talk about the culture and values of basketball. And um, I'm also going to talk about how it affected me. And um, first, I'm going to talk about the origins. The first game was played in December 10, 1891, which consisted of 18 players instead of 10 players. And um, they didn't have enough resources to create and what came to be a basketball. So instead, they played with a soccer ball. So it was um, a little harder. And um, back then, the players were extremely aggressive. They, um, you would rarely get called for a foul if you shove, elbow, or push someone. So um, the, the game has changed a lot to today. So today, you can easily get fouled like by just um, barely touching the player, and um, which led to flopping, which um, when someone touches your arm and like you over-exaggerate, fall back. And um, they do that in every sport, not just basketball, also in soccer, football. So that's what it came to be. And um, now I'm going to talk about the values and culture of basketball. The most important thing in basketball is communication. You're not going to be able to do anything if you just like play and um, you, you have to communicate with your teammates so in order to score. So um, you have to keep talking to them. And um, it also helps your communication skills, not just in the sport, but outside. So, um, and also this sport is an international sport. Every four years, they, um, different nations gather together to play in the FIBA World Cup, very similar to the FIFA World Cup. And um, just like the FIFA World Cup, they are put into groups and, um, and different groups. Um, different nations and um, they battle out and eventually there are two teams left and they battle out to face off each other um, for the Naismith Trophy and um, that's pretty much it and um, now I'm going to talk about how basketball affected me in middle school I didn't really care about school school work or anything I didn't really join anything like sports or clubs so um, that summer 2010 I promised myself I'm going to join something I'm going to play a sport before freshman year of high school. So um, I started to play basketball because um, I watched the Lakers versus Celtics game, game seven. I remember this day perfectly. It was June 17, 2010. Um, both Lakers and Celtics have three wins, so they went at it at game seven. And um, I, I wasn't a fan of basketball, but since the hype was so real in that game, I decided to watch it. And um, the crowd went crazy when the Lakers came back to win it. So. Um, I watched it, so um, after, I didn't know it was a big thing, so I turned on the news to check um, what the commentators thought about the game. But instead of um, talking about the game, it showed a live video of a car being set on fire. So I was like, oh, wow, this is, this is a big thing. And um, that summer, I played a lot of basketball. Summer of 2010, before my freshman year in college, I mean, high school. And um, I grew up to, I went to 5P to 5P4, I grew like four inches that summer, and um, I thought if I would keep it up, I would be six feet four by the end of senior year, and obviously <laughs> that did not happen. I grew up um, from freshman um, year of high school to this day, I think I only grew like three inches. And, um, and that's pretty much it in conclusion. Family, friends are always gonna be first. School is gonna come second, and third, basketball. That's how important it is to me. And um, throughout my speech, I talked about the origins of basketball, the values and culture of basketball, and how it affected me as a person. And all I can say is um, join something. It's good to be part of something, like a sport or a club. It's kind of sad if you just like come to school and go, oh, so join something, so it's pretty cool. And um, that's pretty much it. Thank you.